What's going on guys, it's Shay and I'm back here again with another video. Today we're going to be playing some CRP Maple County. Um, this is like my third time trying to make this video uh, because my internet is absolutely dog water. So hopefully it'll work this time. You know, you've already got some people lagging and that's on my end. So yeah, um, basically what this game is, is it's a role playing game. Uh, I have seen these people, uh, I've played this type of game before in the past, uh, it was kind of similar, it was called FSRP, however, some of the people that used to work there branched off and created this game, which looks amazing, so we'll go ahead and we'll hop into this, so first things first, uh, look at the UI on the screen, you've got your mini map here, which is very cool, you've got postals, which is amazing, uh, and then you've got, it, you know, it locates everything, which is very cool, so there's that. It tells you your current location. It tells you whether or not peacetime is enabled or disabled. It also looks like we got some money in the bank here, and then some on some you know all that good stuff. Uh, and then at the top right, I'm guessing it tells you if you're innocent or wanted. Uh, there are also safe zones. Uh, this is a safe zone. Uh, a safe zone is you cannot kill people. However, if you're wanted, this does not affect you from being arrested. So we'll go ahead and we'll check out this right here. You press Y. You hear your own little phone, which is amazing. Uh, on this phone, you can do a whole bunch of different things. You've got the credits. You've got maps, which is very cool. You've got your emergency contacts, so you can you know type whatever and send it to them. Let them know your location. You've got uh, the weather. You've got the app store, which you can actually download this stuff. It's very cool. You've got your citations. It'll tell you how many citations you have. Uh, you've got your settings. You've got your Roblox store in case you want to buy a Game Pass. Uh, and then you've got your job selection. There are four teams, as far as I'm aware. Uh, there's civilian, PD, sheriff's office, and EMS. Uh, so we'll go ahead and check out each team. Uh, actually, yes. Oh, sorry, hold on. Sorry, I did not scroll down here. There are two extra. There's a pizza paradise. Sorry, paradise pizza and then dropping donuts. Correction, there are five jobs in this game. Sorry, five teams. Uh, so, civilian team, you know, you come in here, this is their car dealership. There are quite a few cars you can buy. Uh, there's also a, like, ranking system for each team in this game. Uh, I would pull it up if I could, however, I'll just read, ki kind of read it. Uh, there's ranks for PD, uh, Sheriff's Office, MS, or EMS, Dropping Donuts, and Paradise Pizza. So, basically, there's seven levels in each of the categories, or teams, uh, and... As far as I'm aware, I'm not very sure how to level up. Um, I think you just play the game. I and mean, I think you just slowly start leveling up. But anyways, you got your car selections here. You can see them all. I won't click on them all, but you can see them here. Um, very, very cool. I did forget to mention that this game is 80 Robux. And I believe it'll stay 80 Robux. Um, you know, uh, as for like for like forever until they change it. That's what they said. So there's that. Um, so there's the cars. Uh, we'll go ahead and we'll switch teams here. Um, the map looks beautiful. Uh, and we'll tour it here in a second. Um, you've also got a bunch of emotes right here. You got like a hands up emotes too. Right there. Very, very cool. So, and then you press tab and it'll tell you everyone that's on the teams. All right. So we'll go ahead and switch teams here. Join the PD. Your call sign. We'll check out the customization, the cars, and the weaponry. You got your customization here. Uh, edit skin tone. You can put on a hat if you'd like. I'll leave it off. You can put on your hair. You know, all your customizable stuff. Um, you got an earpiece as well. Oh, sorry, I thought that was an earpiece, but it's not. Um, you got pants. There's only one for now. Uh, Oprah torso, you've got reflective vest, uh, bless, vest, and body cam. I'll be wearing the vest. Uh, I'm going to change shirts really quickly. Change it to that. Lower torso, you got your deputy belt. And then you can save it if you'd like. And then it'll always be there. Um, so here's the, um, you know, the locker room, which looks amazing. Uh, you got your reception in there. The building looks amazing. Looks very, very good. Uh, we'll go ahead and we'll head over to armory, which is in here. And when we get in here, I'll show you uh, what I mean by the ranking system. Um, so for the ranking system, you can unlock guns and cars, I believe. So pistols, here's the ranking system, you see. 
cadet is the first ranking system and then um you know as you go up it'll give you different things to you know unlock so i can have the glock knight or glock uh rifles see you know you know rank five rank four uh, smgs shotguns uh, and then policing i have access to handcuffs uh pepper spray um taser and the baton which we will equip and the flashlight there is a flashlight and there's a ticket book too interesting okay and then other there's nothing there so we'll go ahead and exit it tells you your rank your rank cadet like i said guys i'm not too sure on how to rank up uh it might tell you in the discord i don't know but you got your booking area right here you know you book them here uh, put them in the cells if you can. I'm not too sure if you can or not. But yeah. And then your police garage right here. A few different uh, options here. Uh, depending on your rank. Um, I believe the first car you get is the Impala. That is correct. So you got the Impala here. Look, Looks amazing. Um, you've got rank 2. You've got your Crown Victoria. Rank 3. You've got your Taurus. Uh, rank 4 is where you get the Charger. Rank 5, you'll get an Explorer. Rank 6, you'll get a Tahoe. And then Rank 7, which is Corporal, you'll get the F-150, which looks amazing. And then you can also edit. Uh, however, you do need to buy the Game Pass to edit the police vehicles. Uh, so I will go ahead and choose the Impala. And we'll go ahead and press Unlock. And Spawn. So, the controls on this are a little bit different than your normal um, RP type game. You got you got Z to start the engine, and then so it'll tell you at the bottom of the screen. You got B to lock your vehicle. C is to exit your vehicle. Um, Q and E is to you know turn signals. Uh, H horn. Very very cool, and that turns on. That's amazing. That looks amazing. Here's your parking brake. Um, and then L is your lights. And what I find interesting, you have to press a few different bus buttons to get to your sirens. You have to press 8, and then you have whale. Yelp. You've got this one. This one. And then press 0 to go backwards. And then if you press 8... Sorry, not that one. Sorry. If you press 9, you've got your different... Um, you've got your different... Um, stuff with the lights here so j this is like very confusing i'm not very sure what i'm doing so if you press j you know three times it'll turn on all your lights like that which looks amazing uh i have in let me turn that off and then k for your um traffic lights i think that's what they're called very very cool uh and then you got m for your takedowns i think uh, oh crap i just pulled up my map Oh, I see. Okay, it accidentally pulls up your map, too. And then... What does zero do? What is this? Oh, wow, your spotlight. And you can move it. That's amazing. Very, very cool. And then, we can just head out on our way. Um, also, if you press U, there is a police um, CAD. Very, very cool, guys. You got your database, you know, you can pull up someone's player name or plate. We'll go ahead and pull up somebody's name real quickly. It'll show their citations. It'll say if they're wanted or not. It'll show their arrests, their vehicles. Reported stolen, no. And then their, their firearms. Very, very cool. Uh, plates, you know, uh, it'll do the same exact thing. It'll come back as the owner. Um, and then you've got call menu. This is where your calls come from, like this. You'll do accept call, which we will go ahead and do that. Uh, responding unit 218. And then you've got the map here. What call was that? So that was the area. Hold on one second, guys. What what was that? This one? Call 11, yes. So if you press call 11. I think, yeah. And then I'm not very sure if it'll tell you where it's at. Uh... Anyways, what is this? Oh, it'll tell you how many people's in the car. Anyways, we'll go ahead and get started on that. 
which is very very cool I'm not sure what that th oh it shows you the speed limit I think and then so you know you've got your lights very very cool the only thing I dislike is that you have to press like two buttons to get to your sirens but you know other than that no, it's all right so there's that uh, see it tells you uh, ran light a cop has read uh, as a cop okay I ran a red light that's my fault anyways we'll go ahead and check out the other team here in a second once we get to this call um, I hear gunshots uh, so it does tell you where the call is at which is very good I'm gonna just run these really quickly All right, it says 65 meters away. I love that it tells you where it's at. Not too many RP games do that. Turn here. There's a pool right there, which looks amazing. Guys, I'm noticing this map looks amazing. Very, very good. Now, I think we're responding to a gunshot wound, I think, or something like that. At the playground right here. So, what you'll do... You'll actually hop out here. There's something right there. What is that? Is that a car? Interesting. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna. You press C. You can. Oh, okay. I see. I see. I see. Okay. How do you help this person though? My question. Call five. Okay. Um. Oh. Wait a minute. You got your panic button up here. You got your. You know. Whether you're on duty, off duty, when you say you're off. Um, I'm not very sure what you do from here. Um, you know, if it's a gunshot wound, I can only suspect that you actually need EMS to help. So this might be more of an EMS type thing. Here's your progress down here where it says cadet. All that good, all that good stuff. Um, so there's that. That's being a cop, you know. It's very, very, very cool. Uh, so we'll go ahead and switch teams here. Um... We'll join the sheriff's office. Oh, you have to press leave first. And I'm assuming the sheriff's office is kind of the same thing. Uh, they might have the same vehicles and all that. So we'll check this out really, really quickly. Um, so here you've got, you know, your like that, which is very cool. I won't put on any here. You got your shirts, kind of the same stuff, just a different color, really. We'll go with that. Uh, pants, they only they also only have one. Stuff is the same here. We'll go body cam. You've got your deputy belt. And then you can deploy. Sheriff's office looks amazing. What's in here? Car garage. Armory. We won't go... We Well, I'm assuming they have the same armory. I'm just going to check regardless. Uh, let's see. They do. They do have the same, I'm assuming. So, we'll go ahead and head over here. Um, let's reception. Where is the car garage? Locker room, car garage. Here's the lockup. Oh, wait a minute. Sorry. View cars. Now, I wonder if it's the same type of cars. That's my question. I'm really curious to see what these look like. Because I actually prefer the sheriff team rather than the PD team. Okay, cool. So it does look to be the same cars. Yes, it is. So I'm assuming everything else is the same. Let's see. Let's see what the lights look like. Oops, I accidentally locked it. Inner vehicle. Okay, yeah, so the lights are the same. Everything's the same. Um. Press U. Is this all the same? Okay, this is all the same. You know, you, you get a call and you, you know, you go to it. Very cool. So, that's it for the sheriff's team. Very, very cool. Look at the sheriff's office out here in the county. Very cool. Now, we're going to quickly switch to um, MS if we can. Hopefully, it's not too full. And we'll check that out. Uh, it does look to be full. Um, so what we'll do. I hear gunshots. Oh, no, it's not full. Okay. 
Uh, team four. No. Oh man. Okay. Teleport. We'll just go ahead and check out this team. It's the drop in donuts. Um. So here's this. Oh wow, that's very loud. Uh, in here you've got. Very cool. Okay, this is very loud. Anyways, you can make your coffees and stuff. All that good stuff. That is like very, very loud. Okay. Use mixer. So you've got all this good stuff you can mess with. Very, very cool. Every Almost everything in here you can interact with, so. You got your use station. Very, very cool. We're going to go ahead and leave the job, though, because there's customers. Okay, oops. And then you get a check. Very cool. Now we're just going to leave that, okay? Because that is loud. Very, very loud. Here's the traffic scene. Looks very good. Wow. All right. So, that's pretty much it. Hopefully, um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to showcase MS because it's just too full. Um, but you get the gist, you know, I'm assuming it's kind of like the, um, the other departments in a way, you know, where you get a call, you respond to it, you know, and there's that. So if you guys would like to play this game, I will leave it in the description down below. Uh, just a reminder, it is 80 Robux. It will stay that way until they decide to change it. Um, so with that being said, please leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys later.